In this episode I was thinking about showing you a little bit of the preparation I have to do with the racing car between the races. Always have to start off the race to take off a lot of part and make it ready for cleaning. As you can see here it's clean and nice. The radiator always have to be checked and cleaned really good. The intercooler will normally is here, have to be taken off every time, cleaned. The suspension and front frame have to be checked every time. Always also have to do bolt check of the subframe and yeah, generally a lot of other parts. It's also important to look around if you see something. Like this one, look at this one. It can make trouble because this is the radiator, here's a rock. And we have the damage, it's always some damage. Check this part, looks good now but look inside here. It's like spaghetti. This is a carbon part, this I have to repair. Okay, let's take it off and bring it to the paint shop. Here we go, off to the paint shop. And don't sand away the paint. Now I'm gonna use this Loctite uh, glue and make the broken parts fit a little bit together. Just like that. So now the carbon layer is ready. Now I'm making some epoxy. I have to mix it. And now, first time I make epoxy now, we're gonna actually change it to um, some special sparkle. So then I use this uh, micro balloons. Now the epoxy is like sparkle. And before we put the carbon, we're gonna use like this now. Make it more straight. Now I mix the new with epoxy without the, the micro balloon. So now we're gonna put a little bit on top here. And I put the carbon uh, layer on top. And then we put even a little bit more epoxy. And last on top there, we put the fill plate, like that. And then I go over even more, like this. Now this part is done on both sides. I also repaired the canal part. Now both of them gonna dry till tomorrow. I have now been changing the gearbox oil that we have to do every time. Pressure test of the intercooler. It's Saturday morning and now we're gonna go and see how the carbon part turned out. And now we can see the result and it's actually really good, just a little bit sanding here now and it's perfect. Sparkle. Sparkle is done. Now we're going to paint some filler. This we're going to do in the box. Filler we have here and uh, additive. This one is 3 to 1 I think. It's have to be really accurate so I think it's around there. Primer is not done, and now it's gonna dry till tomorrow. It's uh, Sunday morning, but well, it's way too early. The filler is now dry, now we're gonna sand it and we're gonna paint the colors. <laughs> Sunday, and on Sunday I always get breakfast in bed. No, that's a joke. It's Monday and I'm 30 years old. Shit, I'm getting old. Nice. Yo, Sexy. I'm getting old. Since it is my birthday today, I have it a little bit relaxed. Now I'm watching you one working. Was? <laughs> I made a practice start. A little bit in this go-kart relaxing and dreaming back how my career was starting. Ah, I've been relaxing enough today. I go home and eat some cake. New green foolie is coming up. So the result is quite good. And it's time for a run. So, finally done with the last run before Osleben. It was a little bit hard today. Yeah, today it was 17.3 kilometers. One hour and eight minutes. That gave me an average speed on each kilometer. Three minutes and 56 seconds. I feel like we're living in 1930 right now. <laughs> To the office work and my sprinter is parked like that it means packing time i'm done loading everything and i also cleaned 
to know is everything ready for start drive to Oslo tomorrow morning or I have some office work and some other stuff left but no problem no stress now